You know, any self-respecting Power BI Pro cannot say cannot say no to a challenge. Yeah, yeah, I think that's right. No, no double negatives, right? So today in the talk Power BI in the morning, Mikhail had submitted three questions, and thank you, Mikhail, for pre-submitting. This is something new. We're talk uh, we're trying for a live talk Power, Power BI. So I, I got online, and the qu the question in question here is. Uh, is his third one where he sent a screenshot and said, you know, I want to transform this table to that table. And I said, well, that's easy, but that's hard. And hard is a scenario that I walk through where the number of items here is unknown. So I'm going to walk you through and, well, I, I think I have a solution. So, and, and it's super exciting. So here we have, so I'll take you through the V1 that we wrote in Talk Power BI, just so you know what the problem is. So let's say we're trying to split employee and skills. And here, uh, you know, what you would think is, is uh, typically you would say just split this column and I'll say split column by delimiter. And here I'll just say comma, can I move this guy? No, I can't, okay. and each occurrence okay and I know there's something buried in the advanced options but I'm not gonna look there I'm gonna say hey split by comma each occurrence hit okay and that looks right <coughs> of course the next step we did was to unpivot other columns and we kind of got the results that we were looking for now we can remove this column oops uh, I know somebody was asking about it. so remove this column remove okay and we can clean this up if you notice that there was some space and so forth so we can say transform uh, text and uh, trim trim I actually so yeah this is this is kind of the result that uh, that Mikhail was looking for but let me show you the challenge here the challenge is imagine the source data changes and here I just have a table that I typed in so I'm going to type in a new one and uh, okay, it's, it's hard to think of names. And we're going to say, but in here, there's going to be a fourth element. Fair enough, right? And, you know, hey, it's source data coming from somewhere. We don't control it. I mean, in this case, I do, but usually you don't. So whatever source data is coming in, and what result do we get? In the end, actually, sorry, I messed that up. I needed four. What did I do? Power pivot, and I still need power query. Oop. Okay, so now we start off with uh, this new row, which has four elements, and now if we go all the way to the end result. Notice that that doesn't show up. The SSC has got dropped somewhere. And you can step by step. And right here, SSC doesn't show up. I mean, as soon as you split, it doesn't show up. So this was problematic. And this is what we're talking about. And I said, hey, there might be an elegant solution in the query editor. And guess what? There is. So I'm going to try this again in V2. And now I'm going to go a different approach. I'm going to say add custom column. Oh, I want to drag this thing. Anyway, and we'll say... Uh, uh, skills split and we'll use one of the functions and believe me I, I can't write functions like this I definitely have the uh, the page open somewhere I did I closed it but uh, you know so that's okay it's okay to look at the reference manual dex.split and we're gonna say we're gonna split skills by comma and hit OK. And now we're going to use the action button. That's what I call it. And expand to new rows. Fair enough. And of course, we're going to just uh, clean, clean this column, format, trim, actually. So we do that. <coughs> but now for the real test. What if an employee pops up with four skills? What happens then? So we're going to go back here. And let's copy here. So now we got four skills, and this is the scenario that did not work in the last example. Are you ready for the new one? Uh, 
Okay, that, that was anticlimactic. I don't know what I did. I thought I typed in four, but maybe not. It's uh, maybe I should have just uh, sourced this in from. Okay. So now it's got four. Drum roll, and there you go. So now it has four, and of course, doesn't matter. I mean, if if uh, I go back, or not I, but uh, somebody goes back and picks up another skill. Uh, so you got one more and all of those show up so now we got one two three four five so it it's totally flexible doesn't matter how many comma separator values come in it's gonna split them out and parse them into new rows just as Mikai was looking for power on my friends